<laughs> hey guys. <laughs> How are you? I won't be long. Um, I really just wanted to directly communicate with those that that pay attention to what I'm doing and that support me. And I wanted to offer some words of inspiration um, and honestly ask a question. Um, for the words of inspiration, I just really wanted to tell you guys that it does not matter what your dream is or what your goal is, you make sure that it is your prime priority to follow what you believe is good for you. Do not live your life trying to impress someone else and do not live your life trying to be someone you're not and do not live your life making yourself miserable just to amount to someone else's idealism. You don't want your life to be the structure of someone else's dream. You don't want to... You don't want your life to be, you don't want to be following someone that's taking you down a dark road. And I really want to tell you that I truly believe, I believe in the human race period. And I truly believe that anyone can be what they want to be. We need people to ideally take care of the world. We need good mothers. We need good fathers. We need people with sources of knowledge. Let's make it not cool to be stupid. Let's make it cool to be a good person. I'm tired of it. Being cool to be a fucking murderer or a shooter or just this this irrelevant being like that shit is stupid. Like the quicker, the sooner we we understand that we need each other, which is the truth, bro. Because I wouldn't be who the fuck I was now if I didn't have anyone. Truly, if I didn't have the support from you guys and I didn't have the people that truly believed in me, I would be nothing. And I, I'm aware of that. And I've gone through my fair share of destruction and, and pain in the process to get where I've gotten and I, and I know that anything is possible. And I really just want at least, if I, if, all right, let's say worst thing comes to worst, I fucking die a tragic death or some shit and I'm not able to see out my dreams, I at least want to know that the kids perceived my message and were able to make something of themselves and able to take my message and use it and turn it into something positive and to to at least have a good life i at least if i'm gonna if i'm gonna die or ever be a sacrifice i want to make sure that my life made at least five million kids happy or they found some sort of answers or resolve in my life regardless of the negative around my name regardless of of the bad things people say to me i don't give a fuck because I know my goal in the end and I know what I want for everyone and I know what my message is. So I just wanted to say I appreciate and love all of you and I believe in you all. Do not let your depression make you. Do not let your body define your soul. Let your soul define your body. Your mind is limitless. You are worth, you are worth more than you could believe. All you have to do is dream and all you have to do is want to fulfill that dream and have the strength to fulfill that dream. Pain is a sign of progress. When you feel pain, there is progress. I love you all. Make sure you have a good day. And I really wanted to um, ask because I found that even when I was in jail and just when um, when I'm home, I, I think about, and I, and I hate to be cliche or to bring her name up, but I think about the, the, girl that, the girl that passed away, the girl that killed herself that I wrote a song about. Um, hold on, sorry, I'm making a turn. I find myself thinking about her a lot, and I find myself kind of being pessimistic, so I just want to know what's the best way to deal with it, because I feel I feel so much, and it's, it's like, to a degree, it's like I, I want to feel that pain, I want to... I want to always feel attached to her because I was the last person she saw, but at the same time, like, I want resolve for myself. So I just, I want to, send me answers, please. That's all I wanted to say. I love you guys. Have a good one.